Hey guys, it's Wes. Not your normal miner here. Today I got a fun one for you, and this is by community request. That's right, you guys, the community, requested a how to, how to mine Raven coin. I'm using AMD and NVIDIA GPUs in the same mining rig um, on Hive OS. That's right, we're going to walk you through how to set up a couple different miner programs in Hive OS on the same mining rig so you can use AMD and NVIDIA GPUs. We're also going to give you a little bonus there. We'll show you how to mine on that CPU as well so you can hammer away some XMR. We got a lot of fun stuff to get to with on this video, so let's get into it. Hey guys, it's Wes. Not your normal miner. Thanks for stopping in. Let's go for a ride. As you guys can see here, we do have um, Hive OS open. We've got one of our workers open here, and you can currently see an A and an N. Well, that A is for AMD GPUs. That N is for NVIDIA GPUs. And these are both hashing on the same mining rig. You're also going to notice here that I've got two different hash rates for Ravencoin. Well, one is for the NVIDIA GPUs, the other is for the AMD GPUs. And the last one that you'll see here is XMR because we are mining on the CPU. So we are going to break this video down. We're going to show you how to mine AMD and NVIDIA GPUs on the same mining rig using Hive OS. As always, guys, in the description down below, we'll have links to everything. Um, the biggest link that you're going to want to check on is the link to Hive OS. Um, please do your own research. Hive OS is something though that we do currently use to manage my own GPU workers or mining rigs, as well as um, the mining farm that we do um, help operate. We use Hive OS over there. Hive OS has a lot of great features. Um, some of the main ones that we like are stability, um, as well as the quickness that things report when we are making changes in overclock settings, as well as just starting rigs up. Um, we've used other minor programs uh, as operating systems in the past, um, Ethos being one of those. Um, very, very slow to do all of those things. Hive OS does have a pretty well-rounded operating system. Lots of fun stuff here. So like I said, please do your own research in the description down below. We'll have a link to that. Um, but we do have, like I said, one of our GPU mining rigs here hammering away um, on that Kapow. We're mining Ravencoin on AMD and NVIDIA GPUs. Um, here you can see that we do have two NVIDIA GPUs. We've got an uh, EVGA 1050 Ti as well as an MSI. Um, 1050 Ti and those are on T-Rex currently and you can see that over there on our on our uh, on our screen well in, in Hive OS if you hit control A you can actually switch miner programs now you can see we've actually got that team red miner hammering away on that Kapow or that Ravencoin and that is on two AMD here we got Radeon RX uh, we got these RX 570s these are eight gigabytes a lot of people have had a lot of questions. They got these AMD GPUs. Well, what are we going to do for life after Ethereum? Well, Ravencoin B could be one of those options. So you actually can mix A and B. Here we got two AMD GPUs and NVIDIA GPUs on the same mining rig. Um, we do have two different miner programs running. We've got Team Red Miner and T-Rex there. So let's go ahead and walk you guys through how to go ahead and do this. We'll get back over here in Hive OS. Um, first things first though guys, you guys got to make your own wallets. For this, we're gonna, you're going to need a Ravencoin wallet as well as an XMR wallet because we're going to show you how to use up that. So this is actually three minor programs going here. But first things first, please go ahead and head to your flight sheets and that's going to open this up. Now, this guys is really, really simple here. Really simple. We're going to go ahead and do coin and we're going to bring that down here to Raven. Select wallet. If you don't have a wallet, you can go ahead and add it. We're not going to show you how to do a wallet. There's lots of other great how to videos. Um, now's a good time, though, if you're new to the channel, make sure you hit that subscription icon in the upper right hand corner. If you like these videos, give us a thumbs up, comment down below, let us know what, what the how to video you want to see next. Now, I've already got my wallet created, so I'm going to come down here to the wallet I want to use, which is Raven on twominers.com. Now, this is where your uh, mileage might vary. To make things simple, I do like to use twominers.com, but there's a list, a whole slew of mining pools that you can use. Whatever mining pool you want, please pick a server that's close to you. And what I mean by that is a server that's on your continent. The closer you are to the mining pool server, the better you are off in the long run as far as connections. Every split second counts. We are in the U.S. We're going to go ahead and click the U.S. pool. Now we're almost there. Now I want to set up to run the NVIDIA GPUs first, that miner program. So I'm going to come down here and I'm going to click T-Rex. 
So what we've done is we've showed you how to set up the two um, NVIDIA GPUs that we've got. Well, now I want to add a miner because I want to set um, Team Red Miner up. So let's go through and repeat this process. For Corn, I want Raven. For Wallet, I want to use the same wallet. You could use a different wallet, but I don't. I want the same wallet. You could also do the same process. We could set up to mine Ethereum Classic and Ravencoin on different GPUs. Guys, there's all sorts of different crazy stuff here. But for this video, we're showing you how to mine Ravencoin using Hive OS, and we're going to show you how to do that with um, NVIDIA and AMD GPUs. Select pool. I want to mine the same pool that we chose earlier, um, the same difficulty, same server, because once again, that's close to my location. Now, since we are setting up the AMD GPUs, I want to use Team Red Miner. I've had really good success with Team Red Miner as well as T-Rex. Your mileage could vary there. Now, this is where the video gets fun. This is for the added bonus. You guys want to mine XMR with your CPU. Well, I typically would recommend doing that to a mining pool. But let's go ahead and add one more time. Coin. Let's go ahead and down here to XMR. Click that wallet. I've already got a wallet made. You guys can skip this part if you just want to learn how to do AMD and NVIDIA GPUs on the same mining rig. Um, my wallet here is this pool. I'm going to click a pool I want. I'm going to click solo pool. I, I, I recommend doing your own research on this, finding your own mining pool there um, to, to do that. So what we're going to do is we're going to find, um, I want to find solo pool there, find the mining uh, server that we want, and I want to do the CPU XMR old. Now we've got this all set. You can name it whatever you want. I'm going to name this not your normal miner. Um, AMD um, NVIDIA test for the YouTube, for our YouTube channel. Like I said, guys, if you guys like this, this is where we're going to go ahead and click create flight sheet. If you guys like these kinds of videos, please give us a thumbs up, comment down below, let us know what you think, let us know what you, what you like about this. Now we're going to go ahead and go back to our workers tab since we created the flight sheet. Now that pops up the miner, our worker that we've got. So you can, like I said, you can currently see that this thing here is hashing. Currently, we got the NVIDIA GPUs, we got two 1050 Ti's, and we got the AMD GPUs, and those are the uh, RX 570's, those are 8 gigabytes. So we've been mining here for quite some time, stability is really great. Now that we've got our flight sheet made, I will go ahead and I'm going to open up our miner program here, um, and open up on our dashboard side, we'll open up our worker, and it even shows that you're separated here, Kapow, up at the top. We've got our miner miner op open, Kapow, and Kapow, and then also random X here. If we scroll down a little bit farther, we're not going to show you overclocks or anything like that. There's lots of great other videos on how to set up your overclocks and everything. But you can currently see we've got two different sets. We've got AMD and NVIDIA GPUs all hammering away on the same mining rig, the same mining worker. Now, I want to go ahead and click flight sheet because I want to adjust my flight sheet. Well, we're going to come down here to the one we just made, and we find not your normal miner, AMD NVIDIA test YouTube, and we're going to go ahead and click on that, the little rocket ship, because we're going to take ourselves to the moon. To the moon, guys. So it does take a few seconds for that to go ahead and pop up. So what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and show you guys that over here um, on the miner program. You can see that on our screen. Um, it's doing its thing. It does take a few seconds um, for that. We are using SSDs versus the thumb drives, and that's really helped with our ability to um, speed things up when we are changing our minor programs and such. So we are heading back here to um, we hit up the minor tab. You will start to see that T-Rex is opening up. And if we go ahead and hit 2, um, double tap that over you can also see that that team red miner is opening up so what we've actually done here guys is we've shown you how to mine with Nvidia as well as AMD GPUs and that is going to be on the same uh, mining rig there same worker guys same worker makes it real easy we just showed you how to do a couple different flight sheets um, you can see that it is starting to um, open up and hash with Team Red Miner. One of the things we really like about Team Red Miner with our AMD GPUs is the ease that it sets the overclocks and the ease that it, it bumps up. It's really great there. You can also see that we are over there on.
on that T-Rex, hammering away on that Kapow. We're putting Ravencoin in the bag. If you guys like this, comment down below. Let us know what you think. Um, here you can see um, after a few seconds, um, that has started to um, show up on dashboard side in HiveOS. So with this video, we've walked you through how to set up Team um, Red Miner, T-Rex, as well as we've also shown you how to um, mine XMR on that CPU. So this has been a great fun video. I've really enjoyed this one. As like we said, by community request, um, you guys, you guys are great. We, we really love being a part of this community. Um, um, but uh, we, we couldn't have, have had more fun showing you guys how to mine um, Ravencoin on um, using Hive OS with our AMD and NVIDIA GPUs. Once again, you can see now that that's been going. Um, a few minutes, we'll switch. Um, we've got. Team Red Miner over here on our RX 570s, those eight gigabytes. And we do have um, T-Rex over here on those um, NVIDIA, these 1050 Ti's. As always, please do your own research in the description down below. You're gonna be able to, um, once again, check out Hive OS and see if that's right for you. Um, hopefully you guys like this video. If you did, comment down below. Um, let us know what you think. Give us a thumbs up. If you're new to the channel, you better hit that subscription icon. That way you can check out all the other great shenanigans that we have out here at the GPU Mining Farm. My name's Wes. I'm not your normal miner. And this has been our How To Mine Ravencoin using Hive OS, um, using AMD and NVIDIA GPUs in the same mining rig or mining worker. And we did show you how to do that using T-Rex um, as well as Team Red Miner. My name's Wes, not your normal liner. Thanks, guys.